friends, welcome to a new story game. This is a 35mm, it's a game by some Russian developers. It's actually written, it just came out, but it's actually done in Unity 4.1, so it's kind of an older version of Unity. Um, so we're not going to have some like global nation, some other fancy new things that are being happening in, in Unity 5. But it looks good, at least on this screen. Um, so it is basically a story of post-apocalypse survival with two people. And you are taking pictures uh, to collect, collect information. And it's kind of a story game. I don't know how long it is. Uh, I've not done too much research into the game beyond that it looks cool. Something I want to try out. So I hope you guys want to check it out as well with me. So let's go ahead and click that new game button. And let's get to it. Yeah, my Russian is so bad. It was not good in the first place, and it's been 20 some odd years since I used it. <laughs> All right. What's going on, man? So, supposedly, there's two people, so journeying together. So, it'll be interesting to see how what a person is or does. This kind of tag is a walking simulator, so I don't expect it to be a lot of combat, but it is kind of a survival y game in a depressing post apocalypse world. That actually looks pretty good. So tab your inventory like kind of normal. Flashlight, camera, and that. Let me check one more quick thing because I I did change the sound, but it still seems a bit. Uh, I'm gonna leave the head bob on for a little bit, and we'll see how that how that works out. Nothing that I can pick up, though. I can pick that whole thing up. Okay. I guess we don't trust our friend when he tells us there's nothing here. Anything in this cabinet? I like how interactable everything is. Oh, um, is that so comfortable? Here, let's bring this with us. It will be our friend. We will call it Bob. No, Chester. His name is Chester. <laughs> it's gotta be Chester, right? Alright, are we going? Are we, are you, are you coming with? Stab you. All right, let's take the camera. Maybe we just need to take pictures of things. Alright Bob, let's go. let's go. Let's bring Chester with us. So you need to click batteries for your for your uh, Are you coming with or what? Let's bring Chester. Let's go. You do him. We are going. Come on. Oh no! Not Chester! You can't leave him behind. Oh, Poor guy. Oh! 
That's cool. <gasps> 35 millimeter. All right. Let the adventure begin. All right, okay. Oh, we can get we can grab Chester. Yay! Okay, let's bring Chester. Ah, <laughs> uh, wrong go, wrong go, wrong go. All right, I'll leave Chester. I know you guys are like, why are you taking Chester with you? Oh, I'll miss you, Chester. I'm gonna build it over here. Sven, get over here. Oh shit, I lost Sven. unfriendly. Sven? My friend, where are you? Oh, shit. If I die right now, this could be Sven's fault. Well, no one's home, at least. <gasps> First aid kit. Oh, yeah. What's this? We've been on the way for about three hours. It was a habit habitable area, but we didn't dare explore it. A kilometer, the tire got deflated. We had to leave the car and stand off the road. Stand out off the road. We sat it out for a few days in the house. It's quiet around the thing, but I heard, heard shots in the forest and hastened to get out. Ah, okay. Okay, put it put back, thank you. Okay, I was scared for a second. But now I'm not scared. I am unscared. I am wrong of the balls. I shall fear no note. Alright, let's see if we can go find Sven. Because it feels like we shouldn't have gotten separated from him. Is that a fucking fire over there, or clouds, or what? Sven! Okay, he was over this way, wasn't he? Oh, there he is. Oh, phew! Sven, you gave me a start! I thought you were bringing Chester with us. No? Hurry it up. He's not very curious, sort. Why does the wind sound so scary? I guess that's batteries and food. Show me. Dude, I will cut you. Uh, should I be scared? I don't know if I should be scared or not. Oh, I already looked around. You didn't follow me last time, you asshat. I could have died. All 
Alright, let's head over this way. So we got a health kit. We found we need to find some more batteries, I guess. It's a pretty quick week. Week. I should really wash my nails. I mean, look at those nails. It's not good. Not good at all. Hello. Hello. Serial killers. Come out. Sven wants to meet you. He's on the name. Do not need. Do not. Do not need. Do not need to go far. I.e. edge of the world. Okay. We should call him something besides Sven. Maybe we should call him Boris. It's a good Russian name, right? <gasps> Stuff. It's Chester's brother. Harold. What the heck? Why can't I open it? Okay. All right then. You should be afraid of me, you things. All right, let's head over. Let's head back to Boris. Boris Svensson. Boris Svenloff. Gibraltar. Boris Svenloff. Gibraltar. That's it. that's him. You cat you seem like you're catching up to me. <gasps> well it's pretty in a creepy kind of way. Why would you give us a knife if it's not gonna be you know, murdering? Boris? Okay, we'll just trust that Boris will catch up at some point. Okay, let's head over this way a little bit. I don't want to lose the road, though. <coughs> Creepy-ass forest. Cuckoo! Cuckoo! I'm cuckoo, I'm cuckoo puffs. Oh, an actual road, road, road. My name is Vladimir. The road. The most depressing movie ever filmed. Let's go left. I no, I wanted to go Boris, I wanted to go this way. Left. When in doubt, go left. Always go left. That's the rule. Have you never played? Oh, Boris, he's not a wise man. If you never played a role playing game before, when in doubt, go left. Well, I guess if I'm facing this way, that is left. So, all right. Let's check. Oh look! When the world was a prettier place. Got some Wawa. What you want us to go across the road? You you want you don't want to go follow the actual paved, probably leading us to someplace interesting path. You want to go this way. This way. 
Lucky. Clickers. Okay. The Alpha. Are we going to be attacked by Bigfoot now? Ah, building. Someone called the camera a little time machine. Ooh, we got several buildings. All right, so. Hello. Hello, evil creatures that will kill Boris and leave me to be. Hello, where are you? Oh, look at the lovely nothing. Okay, so... Alright, well I got in the building. It was very exciting. I'm intrigued to see what's going to happen. It's definitely not a, uh, what you would call, fast-paced game. Nice models. Boris, you coming with? Where'd you go? Boris? Fucker's always leaving me. A dick. No. It's the end of the world as we know it. But I feel fine. Okay, Boris. What the hell are you doing? Can I climb up there too? Oh shit! Murder hounds! Murder hounds! Kill it! Burn it with fire! It's horrible beast! Привет, пёсик. Did it just sound like it? Are you are you made of water? I I don't want to tell you this, but you're fucking ugly. Um, that's it. Aw. Aw. I want to help the pupper. He sounds so sad. I can't even murderize him and put him out of his misery. Aww. Well, that shit's depressing. What the hell, man? Give us a dog to interact with and then take it to... <laughs> Chop off your ear balls. Wear the necklace. Shh, get down, aliens. I just saw uh, 10 Cloverfield Lane. Highly recommend. I will not give anything away because it is a movie where you have to constantly be deciding what's actually going on. But. Great job. John Goodman did an excellent job. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> this is a pretty creepy ass movie. Alright, Boris, you can go that way? Okay, I'll go this way. We'll, uh, we'll catch up later, okay? Uh, 
Let's go check out this path. See what's Well, that was, uh, Boris. Oh, shoof. I lost him again. Oh. Sadness. Sadness! <gasps> Cutscene time. <gasps> Boris? What's wrong, Boris? Oh shit. The cannibal mutants are coming. What the fuck is that? Excuse my language, but... That's my get out of here, Ness. Get out of here. No, Boris! Get back here! Boris, don't leave me to die! Uh, juke. Juke the bear. Juke the bear. You'll never know what's coming. Do not lock me out, Boris. I will stab you. Hurry. Hurry. Boris is going to go in. Oh shit, Boris! I'm sorry, man! You're gonna piss it off! What? What? What is that? A mini desert eagle? Holy crap. Boris saved the day. I'm eating the hell out of things. Okie dokie. The drugs are kicking in. Alright, this is probably a pretty good place to cut it for this first episode. First looking at 35mm. You guys are enjoying it. Uh, it's a very different game. It's very much a walking simulator, but I'm interested in seeing uh, what's actually going on. So for now, it's been Rollable. Click that like button. Let me know in the comments below what you think. Tell your friends, your family, and your grandma, and I'll see you back here for some more mm, photography lessons. Bye-bye.